Hi everyone, it's Paola. Welcome back to another video on my design channel. Uh, if you're new here, hi, welcome. There's been so many new people lately, it's crazy. Uh, hi and welcome to my design channel. I hope you enjoy, I hope you stick around. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, and also follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna try to post more design content on there. We'll see. Today's video, I'm so excited because I've been looking forward to this for a while. I know some of you have too. I am doing the zine collaboration finally. Yes, so exciting. So the zine collaboration was basically this. I asked you, my subscribers, to submit a design that would go inside of this zine that I was creating. So a zine is like a booklet, a book, a magazine, kind of self-produced thing, self-published, and it's really exciting and it's really great for artists. So I asked you guys to submit and then you submitted like a lot like a lot of people submitted. <laughs> and I was only going to pick 10, I said that originally, so I ended up picking 10. I picked the 10 that I felt like best went well together and you know, just what were right for the zine. And I ended up with some really great stuff. So many of your guys' stuff was amazing. You all are so talented and I will definitely be doing more collaboration type things in the future and also critique videos, things like that. So there's always a chance to participate on my channel because I want this to be for all of us, not just me talking or me the authority on anything because I'm not an authority, I'm just here to help. Uh, so let's get into it so I can showcase this amazing work from all these different artists and just show you what I created and you guys get to have. So what we're gonna do is we're going to work together today. I am going to show you the process of picking and designing the actual zine and I'm gonna show you some other processes that I went through to correct, actually create all of it. So let's get into it. This is so hard when you're all so talented, what the heck? Okay, so welcome to design time. This is where I'm going to work on my laptop and screen record for you guys and show you all the stuff that goes into this. So hopefully you guys can follow along in the creation of a zine, but also I'm not going to do like step-by-step -step tutorial as I normally don't, um, but I'm going to show you just the process and the magic and showcase all this fun work. So the first thing I'm gonna do in looking at all of this is just take a look at how the colors go together and just sort of the general layout of the order of the pictures and what I want. So I'm actually just gonna do that right in my folder, uh, just a general thing before I open the files and start working with them. So I'm loving the color scheme of all the things put together. So I feel like it's going to be fairly simple to figure out a layout. There are two that are portrait. So those are gonna be sideways, kind of like posters. Um, and then the rest are landscapes, so they will just go in as the regular pages. Um, so I, it's all about finding a balance right now. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Just the balance of the colors, the general layout, and then we're gonna get into InDesign to actually create the zine. So now we're gonna set up the InDesign file. So the InDesign file for a book, I'm not gonna say create new book. Nope, that's not how I do it. I'm going to say create new document. And then in there, I'm gonna do eight and a half by 11. Yes, the orientation is portrait, but then you're gonna do facing pages because that's actually gonna create what the book is and yes not printing it but digital it's still gonna work and then there's always the option to print it later so this first page would be the cover and then we're gonna start adding pages from here so that would be the first spread which I'm going to save for table of contents um, but let's just get spreads in here and get them going So with that, it's a 24 page zine. And basically like in creating a zine, the hardest part is the actual design. So the hard part is done. Like you guys did all this work. This is really your zine. I'm just going to put it together, help showcase it. And I'm really excited to get all this stuff in here. So first I'm going to just place everything. And really what my job is, is to just tweak everything, make sure it all fits perfectly and just show your stuff in the best way possible. <laughs>
Okay, so now that I got everything into the zine, it's time to kind of rework some of the sizing issues. And actually I might switch around just to like one or two of them because I noticed that the last two have like similar illustration styles and I wanna mix that up. So what I'm gonna do with some of these that are not like perfectly matching up is kind of shift them around. So this one I'm going to just move up to the edge of this paper so it looks more like a poster. I'm actually gonna add some black to this one. I hope that's okay with you. Um, but yes, I just feel like I really wanna showcase that and the black background already is really highlighting it. So I'm just gonna add more black background to fill it out. Okay, so let's think about this. I could put this one here. Let's do that. Ooh, I like that. I feel like all of the pages should be completed. So now let's just add all the extras to the zine. Yay! So now I'm going to create a cover of the we're all together kind of thing and I'm gonna make it really simplified. This is about you guys. I just want to create a nice cover for you guys. So let's do it. So I can't believe I'm saying this, but the zine is complete. Wow, what? What is happening? So I decided to make the cover really, really simple, like super simple because it's not really what it's about. It's about you guys. So I just made it simple, put the participants in, in order, and then you go through and you get to see everyone's work. I am insanely proud of all of you. Like. I'm not any authority above you. You guys are amazing artists and designers and you're a lot of you are better than me. <laughs> like we're all on our own path in design and a lot of you are doing a lot of great stuff. I just happen to have this platform to show your work and kind of be the person to highlight stuff about design. Um, but you guys, there's so much good design out there and you guys are all such great designers. Thank you so much for participating. Wow. Okay, so that was our zine collaboration. It was so much fun, so exciting. I'm so happy for everyone that participated, for the people who submitted, thank you. And to the people that were in the zine, thank you so much. Please check out their work. It will be linked in the description. And also download the zine that is also linked in the description. I felt like this was such a fun project. Don't worry, we'll be doing more in the future, things like this. And yeah, if you like this video, please give it a like. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of the art. Please don't like rip anybody apart. This is supposed to be a fun, supportive community. But yeah, let us know what you think in the comments. We'll talk about it. And what else you guys think we should do for future collabs. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye.